Hello, yes. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma'am. What's your name? My name is Lolita Salipnik. Lolita, how old are you? I'm 33 years old, ma'am. Single or married? Married, ma'am. With how many kids? With two kids. How old are they? Ages uh, 14 years old and 3 years old, ma'am. And your husband is working as? She, he is working? Your husband? Yes, ma'am. What is her? What is his work now in Philippines? Electrician, ma'am. Electrician. Are you high school or college grad? High school graduate, ma'am. How many brothers and sisters do you have? I have three brothers and two sisters, ma'am. And you are? I am the youngest. Youngest. So you don't need you don't need to support your uh, brother and sisters financially. You don't need to give money to them. I need mom, but... You need to give, oh, yes, but need. you don't have money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so you want to go abroad to give money to them. Yes, mom, to support them. To support them. So who will look after your three years old if you go to Hong Kong? My husband, mom. Okay. Your parents working as farmer. Yes. Mom. Is it right? Yes. And... Now your husband is not working anymore, but she's, he worked before in Saudi Arabia. Yes, ma'am. You told me that he got sick? Yes, ma'am. He got accident? No, ma'am. No, he got sick only? Yes, ma'am. So you need to go to abroad? Yes, ma'am. What year have you graduated in high school? 2004 and 2005, ma'am. So, what you did on the year 2004, after 2005? 2005. Yeah, what did you work in Philippines before? Housewife, ma'am. Housewife. Yes, ma when you were to, When you were working, I, when you were studying before, if I'm not mistaken, you told me that you work also in the farm? Yes, ma'am. What are you doing in the farm? Uh, planting rice. <laughs> what else? Uh, carrying car <laughs> carabaos, goats. Uh. Oh, animals. Yes, Looking after animals. Can you describe the work in the farm? Uh, it's hard, mom, but it's enjoying. <laughs> Enjoy. It's fun, yes. I know you have friend in Hong Kong. Yes, mom. That is Sylvia. Yes, mom. And Sylvia is one of the good helper we have. I mean, good applicant we have. And she just renewed the contract with her employer again. Yes. She's very humble. And you have some similarities with Sylvia. How are you related with this lady? She's my childhood mom. Oh, she's your childhood. Yes, and she's recommending you to us. She refer you to us. Yes, ma'am. She said you are hard working. Yes, ma'am. You are um you are good, yes, kind. Everything she say positive. <laughs> Thank you. But do you know that working in Hong Kong you need to be smart? Yes, ma'am. You need to Listen carefully and obey and follow the rules of the employer. Yes, ma'am. Do you think you can work with the Chinese family wherein they are very demanding? Do this, do that, do this, do that. And maybe the temper of mom is always angry. Do you think you can work with that? Yes, mom. I Why? <laughs> Because, so, uh, as I said, I am friendly and I think I can get angry. <laughs> oh, so you can get along with mom? Yes, mom. You think that? Yeah. May I see your hand? Wow. So you, your family came from poor family? Yes, mom. What pushed you to go in abroad? Uh, what I want to earn more money, mom, to for the future of my kids and to also help my brothers. Mm, do you need to support your brothers? Money. You said to yes. me you will give money. Yes, mom. <laughs> because they are just farmer. Mm, they are just farmer. So, what 
are the duties or what are the work of domestic helper? Would you mind to tell me that? Uh, cleaning the house, cooking, ironing, uh, go to market, wash the car, uh, taking the pets, mom. You, do you love pets? Yes, mom. I am pet lover. Okay, dog or cat? Dog, mom. Okay. So you are not afraid of dog? No, mom. You are afraid of cat? Yes. Yes. <laughs> um, you know, in Hong Kong, our house is small, so you need to be share room maybe with grandmother or share room with the kid. Are you okay? Okay, mom. It's okay for me. If they will not allow you for day off, maybe in one month, have four day off, but they will pay money the two day off. Is it okay? It's okay for me, mom. Why okay? She, of course, <laughs> I'm going to earn, earn money. So. Mm -hmm. so make sure you go to Hong Kong to earn money, not to visit your friend, yes, ma not to visit your auntie or who or whoever's that. Yes, ma your goal is to work as domestic helper, yes, ma not as fashionist in Hong Kong, not as a tourist. Yes, ma'am. And I believe that the influence of your childhood, the name is Sylvia, as I mentioned earlier. She's a very good girl. She's very humble. She don't go to any party. She dress simple. She just work and work and work hard. Although she's not quite smart, but she used her heart to work. That's why the employer likes her so much. So listen to me. I know you are not so smart. But I know you have a good heart. Yes, Can you promise me that you will finish your contract? Yes, ma'am. Why you need to finish? Why you need to finish the contract? Can you give me some idea why you need to finish? First, I, I want to be loyal to my employee. Ma Very good. Sounds good. You need to be loyal. Listen. You need to be loyal, you need to be obedient, yes. you need to listen carefully. Don't say yes, yes to mom. If you really don't understand, you better ask not to commit, commit mistakes. And then you must approach mom. If you really don't know how to do things, you approach mom. And if you've done something wrong, you need to say sorry. Say sorry. Yeah. So don't wait for them to discover that you did something. You better tell in advance. Okay, if we broke something, you better tell to mom. Okay, now, if you are looking after a kid, if something happened to your home, like emergency, what will you do? Call, 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 the, my, I call my mom. Call your mom? Yes. How about if you cannot call your mom? <laughs> what will you do? I tell you, if you cannot call your mom, you better call 999. That yes, is our hotline, okay? And are you ready to go in abroad? How about if you feel homesick? What will you do? You miss your kids. What will you do? I'm just enjoying my work, mom. Uh huh. Good answer. Yeah, you need to enjoy your, your work. Now, if you feel homesick, maybe during your day off, maybe you can see them in the video call. You know, nowadays we have Messenger. We have Skype, okay? So try to overcome through that. And although your first time, I believe that you can work hard, okay? Tell me your message to your future employer then. To my future employer, I hope that you, cho you choose me even I am a first-timer because I am hardworking and I'm willing to do my, every my everything. And... I will obey your mom and sir. Thank you. Thank you. And see you in Hong Kong. Bye. Bye.